is another story of the old town of Gaul and its fortifications in Sri Lanka, 200th monument in UNESCO's World Heritage List. Old town of Gaul was fortified by the Portuguese and reached the height of its development under the Dutch East India Company in the 18th century before it fell into the hands of the British in 1798. Sri Lanka gained independence in 1948 and Gulfwood was subsequently designated a World Heritage City in 1988 due to its outstanding colonial architecture. I am going to Gulfwood this Sunday morning through its old entrance built by the Dutch East India Company in 1669. Once the colonial Dutch warehouse was used to store cinnamon, the company's most valuable possession was reused for administrative purposes during the British occupation. It was then converted into a maritime museum by the Dutch government funds in 2010 under the Mutual Heritage Programme. I turned into Church Street and I am now heading towards the old Dutch church. Goldfort is a living heritage city and the Dutch Reformed Church, built in 1755, was conserved in 2004 with financial assistance from the Netherlands and is still in use. Here come two ladies. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Are you going to church? Oh. Seems the church is being painted. Oh, repair is happening on October anniversary. Anniversary? Which anniversary? Do you still have church service here? Oh, when is the service? I think I should come and see. I will join. Thank you. I came out of the church, took a left turn onto the middle street. Hmm, that's a bride and groom taking pictures in the background of a beautiful building. I've been a great one in the a classic. <laughs> But when did you start to like each other? <laughs> but why did you select the fort for wedding photography? Do you feel the same? Okay, I wish you a nice future together. <laughs> What are these beautiful buildings? They seem to be rebuilt or renovated. Let's ask one of the locals. Good morning. Do you work here? It seems you just got a letter. What do you mean by former owner? Hmm. Isn't this a house? What is it then? What happened to the people who lived here? Who owns this now? There's another beautiful building over there. Whose is that? Are there any people living in this street now? No residents? And these buildings? They are private villa. I turned onto Lighthouse Street. There's a typewriter repairer. An old job in an old city. Are you working here since long? 
तीन रेस्टोरेंट है का तो रेस्टोरेंट है का तो इससे ला मंगतरे तुम्हें वर्कशॉप है का राज्य कार्यालय लगा ली दिस के तीन सीएलओ में राज्य कार्यालय सा पाउडर के लिए इतना तेरे में टाइपर फेंक दूँ मामा सो इट वाज योर वर्कशॉप अली है तेरे सेव क्यों था तेरे दिन की थिया और से दंग इन्ने ना मेक दंग निशेध वेला यानो दंग नतीजे ला यानो इतिंग एक बार करंट दे एक नतीजे सा ये बात मेक पैट्टे करती है दी मैं वर्कशॉप का बाहर दा आला रेस्टोरेंट एक पड़ा हुआ था दंग रेस्टोरेंट एक कर गने ना मामा ही मगे नो नहीं दिन ने कुछ वेला एक दंग ताऊ पार पार मगे पार ना कास्ट मतलब इन्नो या तो इतराक ने मैं दंग हुए हुए आगे नहीं ना कटी है तुली ना लुटी देगा ना कटी नया लंका है हुए Do you know since when the residents started selling their properties in the fort? है भाई मेरे का लोग हाथली साहेब ने लोग कुरु में है तीर मतलब मिगाल नाम कल ए नाम कल वाले पास से कपार का संचार के इन्द्र किया गया तो मतलब लोग के व्यूर व्यूर उन्हीं इट पास से लोग के व्यूर उन्हें पास से मिस इन्द्र किया गया तो विशेष एम यूरोपे खाटी है यूरोपिंग नेदरलैंड्स जर्मनी ऑस्ट्रेलिया वो योग के खाटी इन्द्र किया गया तो मैं कि आप इत कोटा स्टीयन हो गया ला वो देखो पायक टीयन बाला ना तो मैं मटाई तेरे दिल को लूँ इन्हें In these buildings now. Then you see, maybe of course, Sudha Tawa may be around here. Maybe not around here. Hmm. Sudha Tawa is not of course. Singhala means Sudha, Muslim means Sudha. What happened to the locals who lived here? Why are they all like that? They are not like that. Hmm. Why did they sell? Who knows? They are all like that. 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 Let's see the interior of these buildings. This one has a swimming pool and the pool has replaced the interior courtyard. I turned into Peddler Street from the Lighthouse Street. Ah, there's a retail shop. I think I should talk to the shop owner. Good morning. Good morning. There are lots of tourists and villas. What happened to the locals who lived here? Why did they sell their houses and move? What was that front door restaurant before? The white one over there? Who owns the earlier bakery? Now? The house next to you? What is that on your table? It looks like a poem. Was he a fort's resident? What kind of person is he? Yeah. मागे बागे तो पीछे नू वैली बते लामा दयासीन वटुना आगे हिंगे मिलट गात सीट कुमेरी देव गनन मागे दुख पता ती ते याली मटमा देनु माना ये क्या ने या या ये गे विकुण्डा विकुण्डे आगे लामी इंगे दिका कोमना आवल गन ये उन्हाटे या देंग ये गे सुधिये गाते भुगे का हाथ पे के या देख काम या तो दिका आई तासा वा कहती है ला या कि यानी इतनी आती थी मट यानी बंदे ने वाना हम किले यामी कि ये ना But why did you keep this poem with you? मट इधर एका कोटु है तो ले मामी इंद्र निशा मट इधर एका ये वन कोटे इतना इतनी में एका होंडा ही गिरा Do you feel sad when your neighbors move after selling their houses? Oh इतना पिक ये ना अन्य पे गिरा इंद्र की अलग ही अन्य I feel I should see this house. Please give me the directions. टू बाय टू बाय टू के लिए देंगे इतना कार्य आती है ने देवनी हांजी का वह अरुण कोटा में किए ना किए थैंक यू सो मच 
Bye. Bye. That's a heart-rendering story. It's getting dark and now I'm heading towards the poet's house in Peddler Street, which was brought by a foreigner. I think this is the place. The shop owner said there's a store called 3x3 three three, and the shop is on the ground floor. The old house was totally demolished and a new one has been built. Let's ask one of the poet neighbors about their memories of the poet's family. How do you feel about your neighbors? <laughs> Every day? Now I'm going to see the poet at his new house in the suburbs of Gaul. Mea <laughs> I am going to go to the house. 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 It was a last colony of the Venacar, the Kadigatum, the Hitia. The last Anugan and Venacotam, Puravida, and Ausra again, Puravida, Salas, and a snooker, with the product Usa Dukala, with the Adi Hatarisa, Kosovo. If I do Karatika, here and only Katuris are some good than Oscarine. Kolomsky Hill, looking, maybe he had to have a Mirko Garavella, can a Puravida Ausra Duna. I really had to look at the time, maybe. Why did you decide to sell your old house? I was in the house. I was Locudohiti, <laughs> Perchak <laughs> But <laughs> Tumahal Mandira Gurnagalatino, Mahisal, the Negro of the Rabbil Rotel Nick, Tinega. I think me have a duca egg at all. 
Here I am. Let's have a look at. Here I am at the Department of Archaeology, which is the highest authority over the heritage management of the World Heritage City. The fort will remain a World Heritage City, but the gentrification process has displaced the residents. Uh, with regard to this particular question, uh, the department uh, again does not have, a, have powers to uh, stop this type of uh, selling the properties and poor people moving out and uh, uh, richer people coming in. Uh, there are two sides of this particular coin. <clears throat> Sometimes uh, when the poor people are there, they use, uh, since they don't have any uh, financial allocations or they are not rich enough to maintain these huge buildings uh, so they tend to uh, neglect them so then uh, there are several dilapidated buildings in this whole fort where the owners uh, are poor and they are not in a position to maintain it so that is one side of the coin and the other side of the coin side of the coin is when these uh, people does not have that money and when they wanted to sell it uh, it is their fundamental rights, so we can't stop that also. So because of that, when uh, if they sell uh, at the moment, uh, I don't think that even the department or any other government institutions in, in Sri Lanka uh, could stop it. Have any steps been taken to encourage the local community to stay in Gold Fort, which will also preserve local traditions and intangible aspects of the urban landscape. Yeah, that is a good question. And if you go through the management plan, which is already approved by the uh, UNESCO or the World Heritage Center, uh, has addressed this particular issue. So what we have uh, identified in per this particular um, uh, management plan or management system uh, we have uh, stated that the Gold Heritage Foundation should be strengthened and then uh, Gold Heritage Foundation should have a separate section uh, for part this particular means uh, approving plans, going through the plans as well as uh, we have suggested that uh, Gold Heritage Foundation in this particular section should have architects and various town planners or anything, uh, any, any persons uh, who could help these poorer people to uh, get their uh, plans uh, prepared free and free advice could be uh, given to them. So that is addressed in this particular uh, management plan. And the second one is that we have uh, again uh, addressed this issue of uh, the lack of financial problem, financial situation of these people. Uh, we have uh, what they call uh, identified or we have recommended to to the government to uh, have a conservation assistance fund uh, under the world heritage uh, under the gold heritage foundation make it da have any lip here sell them give you know then you ගෙදර <laughs> 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 <laughs>